morning. One child is dead and two others are injured after a car struck a mother and her three children who were walking in Westwood this morning. Nine News reporter Jay Warren is live at the scene with the details of this horrible crash. Jay. Well, Kendall, this is where it happened on McHenry Avenue. The family was walking this way here on the sidewalk. The vehicle crossed over those double yellow lines, came up onto the sidewalk and struck that family of four. Uh, we've got video from earlier this morning and just into the newsroom, the names of all of the people involved. Uh, the woman driving the black Honda Accord was a 35-year-old woman, Sheba Basabosa. She was going southbound on McHenry when she crossed over the yellow line, struck a utility pole, and this family of four. Now, sadly, tragically, a three-year-old little boy, Rodriguez Taylor, was struck and killed as a result of this crash. Uh, Jocelyn Austin, a 31-year-old, the mother, uh, she had minor injuries, was transported to uh, Children's Hospital, I understand. And then uh, uh, Ricardo Taylor, a one-year-old little boy, was also transported to Children's Hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Uh, alcohol is believed to be a factor in this. And at the scene, we were told that the, the driver was charged with OVI and likely other charges to follow. Let's take a listen to what the police were saying this morning. Anytime you have any, any kind of injuries or any kind of crash of this kind of sort, of course, it's going to be obviously... It's going to be sad. It's going to be detrimental to the family, but we have to now go ahead and hope for the best for the rest of the kids at this point, as well as for the, for the family and their, on their loss at this time. Just a terrible accident here on McHenry. Again, a woman driving, uh, Ms. Sheba Basabosa, was coming along McHenry and uh, crossed the double yellow and struck this family, and a Rodriguez Taylor, a three-year-old little boy, was killed. Jay Warren, 9 News, Westwood.